Hey everybody, let's talk about the Troy Built TB360. This is the 21-inch uh, option I'm using this year for season 2016. Um, I bought this toward the last uh, quarter of 2015, and this thing is awesome. It's got what I've been looking for in a 21-inch mower. Um, it's got everything I want. It's got a 190cc motor uh, by Briggs and Stratton, and that's that's a Haas motor right there. And it's, they call it the, the professional series, so whatever. 190 cc. Normally on these 21 inch Troy builds, you'll find 160 cc. Um, this is 190 cc on a 21 inch deck. It's the um, it's the same cc's, but not necessarily the same. Um, uh, what's it called? Oh, it, it doesn't have the same torque, but it, it has the same cc's as a uh, the big 30 inch Time Masters. So. I mean, you're, you're talking a very similar motor here in power, not torque, okay? The, the, the Time Master has more torque, but this one has, you know, 190 cc. The horsepower is right up there with it. Uh, pretty big gas can. Lasts you a long time. When you fill that thing up, it lasts you a long time. And uh, it's got the wash port, which I've never used on a mower. I've never, ever, ever used a wash port on a mower. I just, you know, if it's got, if I got issues with it, I flip it on its, on its lid, oil side down gas and carburetor side up I just flip it up and reach underneath there and clean it off um, I've never used that it is rear wheel drive so that I really like rear wheel drive better than front wheel drive I always feel that a front wheel drive self propelled mower starts going like this on me and it really irritates the piss out of me and it starts to bounce especially if you're using a bagger so um, I like rear wheel drive and it also has it comes with the bag attachment and it comes with the side chute. So you can mulch, you can side chute, you can bag. Either way, this mower works fan freaking tastic. Um, it's got, let me show you really fast how easy it is with the side chute. The mulch plate stays on, so you just take this up and pop, and there you go. Now you're bagging. Um, you can take the bag off and then you'll be mulching. And all it is is it just holds underneath the hinge here. So that, that's all you got to do to mount that. Super simple to mount your, your side discharge. I just keep that in the bed of my truck in my toolbox. So I always have it with me. And then your bag attachment uh, goes on super simple. And the, the door has its own butt plug that goes down and makes the, uh, the mulching plate. So boom, done deal. So there you go. Um, it's now in mulch mode which is really cool. It's just that simple. And then uh, it's got one lever height adjustment right here. Let me make sure I'm not blocking you. But right here, you can adjust the height of your, it, it does all the wheels together. So that's kind of kind of cool. You don't have to sit there and, and mess around with this wheel and that wheel or whatever. One lever, boom, the whole mower goes up and down to whatever height you want. And um, gosh, I had a problem with it and I had to get this mower fixed under warranty and Troy Built has a two-year warranty so I took it to the local dealer here I bought this at Lowe's I called Lowe's and said hey I got a problem with the motor I think it's got a valve issue um, and they said call so-and-so local shop that has the contract so I brought it in two-year warranty sure enough the um, the valve the exhaust valve it's like the rocker arm or whatever came out of adjustment the bolt came loose simple fix would have cost under fifty dollars but Troy built gave them a pay ticket and did it under warranty so they fixed it for free it runs like a champ the mower is in the shop for a couple weeks um, well about 10 days and uh, you know it would have been it would have been 50 bucks they took it they had to take it apart and find out why because I could hear it backfiring as I was trying to start it it was backfiring to the carburetor so I knew the exhaust valve was hung um, I just didn't know why so that's the deal um, so I brought it to them they fixed it two-year warranty can't complain I mean this machine doesn't get used very often but you know this time of year it does and come March when the um, you know we'll have a, a lot of dew in the mornings and then it then it'll um, it'll melt away and so the ground when the season starts again the grounds are going to be very very wet very wet 
um, lots of morning dew, and then it then it's gonna you know um, almost like ice and very very close to frost all over the the grass. That's the best way to say it. And then the sun comes up and the frost turns to water and the ground just stays saturated through the end of March um, to the, like the first week of April until that frost goes away. So this machine is going to be used a lot during that time, just getting yards back in shape, um, getting their first cut out of the way. So it was really important that I had a good running uh, rear wheel drive machine um, that I'd be able to start the 2016 season with. Now, um, this doesn't have the, uh, the lever to self-propel. This is kind of like the, the Time Master and the, the personal pace that Toro does. The more you move the bar, the more it goes. So you don't have, like if you're in a turn and you're out here and you turn your machine, you don't have to reach down to grab the bar. This you hold, that, that's your engine. But you don't have to hold the machine and reach for the handle to pull the lever up for self-propulsion. You can go like this and just whoop, and she just starts going self-propelled. So, so you could flip a bitch and go like this and she starts moving for you. And you can go ahead and align yourself back behind the handle properly and, and mow the yard. So that's also something that was really, really cool. I think I paid uh, $369 for this machine at Lowe's. Um, highly, highly, highly recommend it. Again, it's the Troy built TB360. And this right here is so important. That's what's gonna keep your blade RPMs up um, so you can mulch, you can side shoot, um, you can bag. The vacuum is really, really good. It's, I mean, it's really, really good. Uh, this thing really works nice. And I have found that I actually will use my mower and side shoot all the leaves into an area and then I come with my bagger and I just bag it up. Um, it gets one more mulching onto the leaves to make it even smaller and I kind of use it like a lawn vac and then I don't have much debris at all to take away. It just all fits into that bushel and we're done. So, or bag attachment I mean, and we're basically, we're done. So that is the uh, Troy Belt. So that's a walk around tour. My review, love it, get it. I mean, it's, it's a very simple, easy machine. It starts on the first or second pull every time. You don't have to prime nothing. Just squeeze the red handle and, and pull the cord and she fires up for you. Um, the two year warranty was awesome. Very rarely do I have issues with my machines. Um, it's great that Troy Built has the two year warranty on this. Um, I did not tell them I was using it for commercial use. So, you know, if you buy it and you gotta bring it in for warranty, you know, don't tell them it's for commercial use. So I don't know what the commercial use policy is, but I know it says two year limited warranty. I called them up and they said, yep, two year warranty, bring it on in. And that's just what I did. So there we go. The Troy Built TB360. And then, so earlier today, see there's my mower. Got the hedge trimmer mounted in the back where it's supposed to be and everything's all lined up just the way I like it. And I just throw my little mower in there and shut the door. Now the only thing I gotta do is I gotta mount my blower. Um, not in a big, big rush to mount my blower because this mower, this blower is gonna become my spare blower here real soon. I'll be buying a, uh, a new probably 600 here shortly and that's going to have a slightly different mounting um, way to secure it than this one so I'm just kind of waiting to see what we're going to do right now it's fine it just hangs out right there um, so that's it got any questions or any comments please feel free to leave them